is a featherweight matchup between Clay, the Carpenter Guido, and Tatsuya, Crusher Kawajiri. Tatsuya Kawajiri, very confident that he will come away with a victory tonight. This guy is a leg lock and arm bar specialist. If he gets a hold of a limb, you are in deep trouble. Katsuya Kawajiri steps inside the octagon and he's ready to fight. Clay, the Carpenter Guida, pumped up, very confident, and ready to battle in the octagon. Clay Guida may have the best cardio I've ever seen inside the octagon. The man literally never gets tired, and he is also one of the most loved fighters in the history of the sport. Set to fight Tatsuya Kawajiri. Our tale of the tape for this featherweight fight. Kawajiri is three years his elder. The rest is virtually identical. And now with our official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting. This man is an ex martial artist, holding a professional record of 35 wins, 8 losses, and 2 draws. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Petsuya Crusher! Come on, G! And now, of course, he's a bone, fighting at the record. This man is a freestyle fighter, holding a professional record of 32 wins, 14 losses. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, USA! Clay the Carpenter! We And when the action begins, our Our referee for tonight's fight is Eve Levine. Ready? Here we go! Tonight's fight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Black trunks for Kawajiri. White trunks for Guida. Joe, there's no question in Clay Guida's heart. He is a grinder. But what he hasn't been able to do more often than not is finish fights. That may be true, Mike, but you got to realize that he's fighting the very elite of the division. He's fighting the Tyson Griffins, the Mac Danzigs, the Diego Sanchez's of the division. He's fighting the very toughest guys in that weight class. Both fighters are tentative here, Mike, really respecting each other's abilities. He continues to score with his strikes. Oh, and another powerful leg kick. He's looking to slow his opponent down. Absolutely, Mike. Knee to the body. Very good overhand. Those are really starting to do some damage. Absolutely. There's a nice inside leg Both kick. Both men exchanging. Kawajiri with a solid right kick to the body. Yeah, he's digging into that leg kick. Misses with the kick. Doing an excellent job of mixing up his strikes here. The huge head kick is blocked. He missed that kick. Guido with the hook. Man, he's really mixing things up nicely, isn't he? He's being unpredictable, that's for sure, and that is important. Kawajiri with a strong leg kick. He's really doing a good job of controlling distance and getting off these shots. 
One overhook, one underhook. Nice knee inside. Good knees by Kawajiri. Nice leg kick. He got tagged there. Joe, we're starting to see the damage that those big overhands have done. Look at the right eye. It's starting to swell. He's got a beautiful leg kick. Kawajiri with a good jab. He's taking some shots now. There's Game another one. Kick. He misses with the overhand. Kawajiri gets caught with the overhand left. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Kawajiri with a solid double jab. Very nice timing with these shots here. 15 seconds remains. His ears are ringing from more than the bell that just saved him. He got stunned right at the end of that round without question. Let's see it here again. And let's take a closer look at that from a different angle. The lovely Carly. Ready? Ready? All right, round two. Now, starting off this round, he might still be hurt. He's going to want to look to be defensive and move and avoid getting hit and try to recover. Big Huge power hook. in that hook. Missed with that overhead. Good defense. Nice block. Excellent job of timing these combinations. Let's go inside the numbers and check out the body strikes landing. Another big leg kick. So much damage has been done. These have been nasty. The right hook misses. Big front kick, nice nicely front done. Kick. Wow! Oh, he's in big trouble. And an elbow. Big takedown. That punch had knockout written all over it. Guida with a nice overhand. Joe, that was well done, blocking the punch. Nice kick. Now his other eye is really swelling. And huge strikes now. He misses with the kick. Kawajiri with a solid kick. Very nice kick. Wow, he goes down. Dives in with the punch. Under two. Nice leg kick by Kawajiri. Tatsuya Kawajiri has got to be very pleased with his performance here tonight, Joe. He certainly has done a really good job of landing big shots in this fight, and that's what so far is getting him ahead on the scorecards. Looking for a takedown. Man, you can truly see the damage those vicious kicks have done. He's got him down. He's back in half guard now. Oh, beautiful sweep. Big oh, right he hand. rocked him with that right hand. Thirty seconds. the kid.
KO victory as the round was ended. Once again, here's our fight replay. And as we can see here in the replay, it was the hook that ended this fight. Let's see it one more time. Look at the power in this hook as it lands for the knockout. Check out this angle here. Boom! And he's out. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 44 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Katsuya Crusher! Go Tatsuya Kawajiri, victorious with the knockout.